Hello and welcome back for another Fast Freight 5, sponsored by Saracis, the transportation management solutions company. More recently, it has become clear that being distanced from end customers comes with a more significant cost, the inability to identify and quickly react to their needs. The 2018 JDA Intelligent Manufacturing Survey found that 44% of manufacturers are focused on improving forecasting with demand sensing, and this requires a clear line of sight to end customer behavior, starting with infrastructure to go to direct to consumer shipping. It is not enough for manufacturers to make superficial changes to their website to get end customer to visit by chance. B2B manufacturers and distributors, like their B2C counterparts, need to consider the breadth of their customer journey, particularly because it is more complex and drawn out and includes more than one decision maker and end customer. That's why we want to give you the five considerations for manufacturers and distributors to go to direct to consumer. So let's give you five things real fast. Number one, critical infrastructure to support direct to consumer strategies. Direct-to-consumer strategies require significant technical infrastructure for success, the most obvious of which is a digital commerce system designed for the end customer. On its own, however, e-commerce will not deliver the insight required for end customer behavior to power corporate decision making. For this, there's a need to generate context for user demand through the integration of a content management system and an analytics platform to monitor and make sense of user behavior. Number two, critical customer expectations, the Amazon effect. Amazon's business model is rippling through virtually every stage of manufacturing go-to-market strategies. Many commentators focus on customer expectations of very short delivery times and the pressure this puts on supply chains. Equally clear is that it is changing service expectations of B2B customers. One element of the Amazon effect is that customers are demanding more transparency from vendors throughout the supply chain track and trace systems that can send detailed updates in real time being one example. Number three, critical customer experience features. Meeting end customers' expectations of how a B2B manufacturer's website and buying process should look and feel requires critical features that support how they gather and interact with information. Number four, behind the scenes. Your front-end customer-facing website has to integrate seamlessly with back-end systems, much like our Saracis Raider integrating to major e-commerce shopping carts, such as payment processing and inventory management, to ensure orders are processed quickly and reach the consumer without issue. These back-end systems include everything needed to manage your warehouse and orders, process payments, and prevent fraud. When selling direct to consumer, your focus will shift from retailer slash distributor relationships to fulfilling orders for customers, and the technology you'll need is vastly different. Number five, implementation and integration. Selecting the right technologies to support your direct-to-consumer initiative is just the first step. Getting them up and running and working together is the equally important next step. You've invested in technology to support your broader business, so integration with this new method of selling is critical. Make sure you have the right resources to execute and drive results in a timely manner. Direct-to-consumer is a big endeavor and requires an investment, but there are alternatives to building this on your own. While some brands attempt to piecemeal various partners and solutions to achieve their direct-to-consumer goals, the customer ultimately suffers. Remember, consumers don't interact with individual departments. They form a relationship with your brand as a whole. What considerations are you making for direct-to-consumer initiatives? Let us know in the comments below. Thanks for watching and have a great week. Well, before you go, make sure you click over here to check out all of our TMS videos, click over here to subscribe, and click up here to go to saracis.com.